A classic novel, movie, and now a Broadway show will be the next to take the stage at the Denver Center for the Performing Arts. To Kill a Mockingbird opens at the Buell Theater starting January 24th. Emmy Award winning actor Richard Thomas stars in the show and sat down with CBS 4's Dylan Thomas. When I was a boy, it's a tale generations of Americans have grown up with. Air rifles. It's our story. It's America's story. It's the story of our aspirations to be just and the ways in which we succeed and the ways in which we fail. And it was a sin to kill a mockingbird. To kill a mockingbird. A crime against God. A story of race, prejudice, and community. Because they were innocent. A story many of us read in school, yet applicable to all generations. Everybody reads this book in school, uh, but it's not a young adult novel. It's a, it was a novel written for adults. If Emmy award-winning actor Richard Thomas stars in the show, which plays at the Denver Center for the Performing Arts starting January 24th. He says the show still carries the same message, but with modern takes. Definitely uh, taken Atticus Finch off his pedestal as a white savior. I was a fan of the show before I got the offer to go on tour. Melanie Moore was thrilled to be cast as Scout in the show. It's a uniquely American story. It is for everyone, no matter your background. She and Yegel Welch, who plays Tom Robinson, say the takeaways from To Kill a Mockingbird are still ringing true in 2023. We've come far from 1934, and some of that stuff is still happening today. Being a Black male, I can't help but relate when I see these stories. I can't help but feel connected. I can't help but feel like this could be me. The stars of the show say they hope their take on the classic tale sparks conversation. We hope that people sit in the audience and look at it and say, oh my gosh, why does this look so similar to what I've read about last month, last year? And how can we actually come together as a country, as a, like a planet, to make it not look like that anymore? Dylan Thomas covering Colorado First.